Oh hey, didn't see you there. How's it going everybody and welcome to another Angle On. Today I'm going to be recording Donkey Kong Country Returns, Episode 9. Yeah, I know, this is weird having one in the middle of the series when I think I said a long time ago that if I was going to do this again, I would probably do like the first episode or the finale. But the last time I did one of these was during Octo Expansion, which was 10 Let's Plays ago. God, wow, that's been, it's been that long, holy shit. Anyway, I'm gonna be doing another angle on for Donkey Kong Country Returns today. Uh, thankfully, now that I have a extra spare old laptop that I can use for different purposes in terms of, like, work-related things, I have an extra webcam to use, that way I don't have to use the setup I use on my main setup, which houses all of my recording stuff, like Audacity and my other OBS, in which I can record my 3DS gameplay. But, without any further ado, I'm going to open the game, and I'm gonna get things started in terms of already syncing up the audio with the video for the purposes of my face, I also need to do a sync up for actual for the actual Let's Play video itself. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna do this. We're gonna press A on the title screen, then we're gonna hop into game one, which is my file for the Let's Play, and then I'm gonna sync things up as such. Two, one, two, one. Simple as that. It'll probably make a lot of sense. I'll probably, like, it'll be weird how I edit this. It's always weird when I go to edit these videos because I gotta do, like, double the editing. But nonetheless, I'm gonna open the one-player game, and I'm going to hop in and begin the episode. So sit back and relax, because it's time to begin. How's it going, everybody? And welcome back to another episode of Donkey Kong Country Returns. Last time, we continued our ruined adventures here in World 3 by taking on the Itty Bitty Biters and going to the Damp Dungeon. This time, we're gonna probably finish off World 3 if I had to guess, starting with 3-6 Temple Topple. Alright, so we can see that a Rambi barrier is in the way, and there is a puzzle piece here too, so finally we're going to be seeing Rambi again. It's been way too long since we've seen Rambi. However, if only we could see other animal buddies like, you know, Winky. I'm not I'm not going to let that go, Nintendo, or I guess Rare in this case. Uh, well, not even Rare anymore, but, uh, well, technically Rare because Winky was only in one game in the original trilogy, so... It's both Nintendo, Rare, and also Retro Studios at this point. I just want Winky back, man. Give me my Winky the Frog. Hopefully in Donkey Kong Country Returns 2, 3, whatever you want to call it. That ever, if it ever comes out, rather, on the Nintendo Switch. Hopefully we can get Rambi, uh, well, hopefully Rambi comes back, yes. But also hopefully we get more animal buddies such as Winky the Frog in that game. Alright, so of course, as we know from the first time we encountered Rambi, Rambi can destroy spikes and pretty much destroy a lot of things. Rambi's kind of invincible to a lot of stuff, and Rambi can also break some rhinoceros blocks, such as the one that was blocking that puzzle piece. Alright, so we're gonna continue on with Rambi here. We got the K already, so that's nice. Let's jump with Rambi, thank you. Let's refill on Rambi, even though we technically didn't even need to. Okay. Let's go ahead and destroy some, uh, I guess, what do you want to call these? They're not really punching bags, but we can still destroy them nonetheless. Alright, let's continue on our pathway with Rambi. Ooh, rings of fire? Don't mind if I do! Burning rings of fire. Okay, Rambi, get back here. Thank you. Okay. Thankfully, unlike the uh, original Donkey Kong Country games, uh, the animal buddies don't, like, run away in complete fear whenever they get hit. What sucks though is that we have to at least grab the K all over again, which kind of blows, but hey, it's no big deal. And also have to re-grab Diddy, but you know, that's no not really a big deal either. All right, let's just go ahead and get to Rambi. Come on, Rambi. Where are you, my rhinoceros buddy? 
All right. Let's get back down here, grab the K, and we can just move on already again, so that's nice. Thankfully, grabbing puzzle pieces is kind of convenient, because then we can just not have to grab them again, which is a real lifesaver, if I gotta be honest. Thankfully, that's, like, one major thing in this game. Anyway, we have toppling temple stuff. Oh, wow, actually, that was a lot of tumbling toppling goodness. All right, let's actually destroy this stuff here, because there is an area waiting for us down here. It is a bonus area. Okay, we can only go this way. All right, bonus area right here. Rambi goes away for just a second, so we can actually do this bonus area. Oh, and it's one of these with limited items that we have to collect that are flying all over the place. Okay. Oh, I missed the... Uh... Well, I missed everything but a single banana coin and also technically the puzzle piece, but, you know, it's... It's whatever. All right, let's just go ahead and refill on Rambi again, reaching the checkpoint. Okay, very nice. And now we're out, so look at this. Just look at the beautiful scenery of this outside. It is so awesome. All right, we got the uh, third puzzle piece right there. Just need to be a little careful. Ooh, wow, actually we get a platform. That's actually very convenient. And Rambi ended up destroying that enemy anyway, even though I wasn't on top of him. Cool. <laughs> Thanks, game. All right, let's go ahead and grab that. Ooh, it turned into bananas. That's actually really nice. Rambi's gonna refill our uh, ditty meter there. <laughs> our ditty meter. All right, let's just go ahead and destroy this. Let's be a little careful here. Nothing, okay. Let's just destroy all of this here. Again, we're gonna have to be careful because eventually we're gonna be coming on a bit of a crossroads. And by crossroads, I mean lily pad jumps. Oh boy. Well, they're not even lily pads either. They're just like... Oh boy. Ooh, okay. Ooh, safety in numbers, safety in numbers. And by safety in numbers, I mean safety in Diddy's jetpack. All right, a heart that we honestly didn't really need, but I'll take anyway. Some bananas, okay, not bad. Let's destroy this. Let's topple this over. Another checkpoint, I will gladly take that, especially because this last area is gonna be a little hectic. All right, so we're gonna have a lot of tumbly topplies, and it's not very fun, so let's just keep going through here. Is this another puzzle piece? No, it is not, okay. Well, that's fine. Got the G. Okay. Okay, oh boy, careful. And that's the ending. I think I missed another puzzle piece, but hey, honestly, who cares? I got the KONG Kong, and like I keep saying, that's all that really matters when it comes to Donkey Kong Country Returns. All right, forgetting the Kong letters in all of the levels prior to this one, as well as this one, we ended up unlocking the bonus K-level temple, the Shifty Smashers. Oh boy, this one should be very, very fun. Gotta be honest, going into this Let's Play, I hadn't played a lot of these K levels in a while, so it might be a little troublesome, but hey, this one doesn't seem like it's too bad. I mean, it looks like it's just platforms going back and forth from smashing me, so I mean, it shouldn't be too bad, right? Right? I mean, really, actually, it shouldn't be that bad at all, at least compared to the previous ones. All right, that's not a complete crush, so I'm just gonna wait here. Okay, so I know where my openings are. Not right there, right here. Okay, just be super careful. And by super careful, I mean get crushed, but thankfully it only takes away a heart. You don't 
It's not like most games where you get crushed and you end up losing all of your hearts, so that's at least good. Okay, that's not good, though. Let's grab a puzzle piece. Let's move. Okay, again, there are no checkpoints in these levels, so we do need to be super duper careful about what we do. Okay. Alright, in order to get this puzzle piece, I need to be super quick about this. Okay. Nothing in that. Alright, so we're gonna be careful here. We're gonna take things nice and slowly. Because these have spikes above and below, so we're going to be super careful. Okay. There's no safe spot there, so we just need to be very quick about what we do. Okay. There we go. Alright, we made it through there. Not bad. Not bad at all. Okay, now we're back to this area here. It's okay if we lose Diddy. I mean, it's not, but it is okay if we do lose Diddy. Hopefully we won't, though. Okay. We're gonna be as careful as we can. Trying not to get crushed. Okay, perfect. There is a puzzle piece here. We're gonna go for the puzzle piece. Okay, we can go ahead and come over here. Excellent, okay. So we've made it past this, and now it's gonna be kind of like a big old gauntlet of running past things, that's okay. And that was actually it. Wow, that was a lot simpler than I thought it would be. Let's go ahead and grab the treasure. How would I do that? And we completed the puzzle piece, which means something's been updated. It didn't say what, though, so I'm a little confused. Alright, and with that, we only have one level left to do, and that is to go into the Ruined Roost. Alright, so it's already boss time here in World 3, so let's go ahead and break open Diddy, and let's get this cutscene going. A little bit of an insider secret for this Another Angle video, I'm currently playing Pokemon Go on the side, right over here, on my, uh, tablet. Alright, here we go. It was Cockatiel in Captain Toad and Mario Odyssey before Cockatiel. Let's go ahead and grab a bomb. And let's toss it. There we go. We got the hit off. Very nice. Alright, so basically we just gotta hit uh, co not Cockatiel with bombs. I don't actually remember this boss's name. Alright, let's go ahead and grab the bomb. We should be able to hit it. There we go. Alright, second hit already. Now, this boss is going to do some deep diving over through here, so we need to be very, very careful. Basically, this middle part is where we want to be. And then, we have some rockets that are going to be coming into play, too. However, we also have these little wired bombs that also do some fun stuff. Oh, we missed the bomb. That's unfortunate. Uh, but those bombs with the flames on them, those bombs will ignite stuff and just have a sprinkle all throughout. There we go. Alright, we got the next hit. Perfect. So yeah, it's gonna have a, like a line of fire just going all throughout there. Alright, coming up next should be the rocket, and the rocket is going to destroy those bottom platforms, so just need to be super careful. 
about what we do there. We got that hit. Wow, I am very surprised. Oh, oh, I thought we were going to get hit there. Somehow we didn't. All right, here comes some bombs. There we go. We got an extra hit off. Okay, get a heart back for Diddy because we did end up losing one. Duck down, avoid the not cocktail again. I forget this boss's name. All right, fire explosions. Ooh, we just missed out on that hit. Dang it. Let's be super careful. Oh, we actually hit it. I didn't think we did. Well, okay. Thanks, game. Fourteen hits on the Tiki boss. Unfortunately, not as many as the last couple boss fights, but hey, the music gallery's been updated, and the diorama gallery has been updated. Two for the price of one, baby! The ruins have been conquered, so now the Kongs can head to the caves. Next time on Donkey Kong Country Returns, we begin World 4, aka the Cave World, by going on some rickety rails. Until then, thank you for watching, and I will catch you later. And that does it for episode 9's recording of Donkey Kong Country Returns, which means that is gonna do it for this edition of Another Angle. Also, you might have noticed my t-shirt, my collector shirt. It's brand new on my shop, thejamesrolls.shop. Go ahead and pick one up there. And yeah, pick up something there, because that helps support me, and that's really cool. Anyway, that's gonna do it for this edition of Another Angle. Hopefully it doesn't take another 10 Let's Plays for another one to happen. But until the next one, thank you for watching, and I will see you then.